We're going to use the market for T-shirts to explain the impact of the imposition of an import tariff. We start by drawing a diagram of the market for T-shirts. On the vertical axis, price, horizontal axis, quantity, demand curve, and the supply curve. And where the two intersect, we have equilibrium, let's assume, equilibrium price of 50, equilibrium quantity is 1,000. Now, this is the position before trade. The market is equilibrium, so both producers and consumers are happy. Now we open up the market to imports. We can import as many teachers as we want at the price of 20. In other words, this price of 20 is the world price. And we are a small, we, a small player in the market and we can import as many as we want. Now the question is, how will this price of 20 affect the local, local market? To investigate that, we're first going to look at local producers, the supply curve, and then at the effect on consumers, the demand curve. Okay, price of 20. Now some of us would recognize that what in fact has taken place is that the price decreased from 50 to 20. In other words, there's a movement along the curve from this point to this point. So local producers willing to produce, say, 600. And consumers? Well, again, at the price of 20, there's a decrease in price from 50 to 20, a movement along the curve to this point, and local um, demand increased to 1,200. So the quantity demanded, the price of 20 is 1,200, and the quantity, local quantity supplied is 600. And the difference? Yes, this difference of, of 600, that's the value of imports. So, at a price of 20, Quantity demanded, quantity demanded equals 1,200, and quantity supplied, well, that's also 1,200, of which 600 is the value of local production, plus the imports of 600, that's 1,200. So everyone can see at this point, quantity demanded is equal to quantity supplied, and we have Equilibrium. Now, let's see what we have so far. Local producers produce less, so they're worse off, but consumers are better off. They get cheap um, t shirts at the lower price and the quantity demanded increased. But these two aren't the only parties that are affected by the by trade. Because of the decrease in local production and demand for labor will also de decrease. Remember, demand for labor? Labor is a derived demand. So, quantity produced decreased. So, some laborers in the t shirt market um, production will lose their jobs. Now, Casato, whoever, Casato looking after the, the uh, interests of, of laborers, will go to government and say, okay, but our members are losing their jobs because of cheap imports. You must protect us. Government can introduce a tariff. And let's assume we introduce a tariff of 15 rand on every T-shirt imported. So what in fact takes place is that government increases the price of T-shirts, imported T-shirts from 20 plus 15 to 35. So the new price of T-shirts is 35. And we can do the same exercise. What is the effect of this price of 35 on local production? And then we're also going to have a look on the effect on, on, on consumption. Firstly, then the supply curve, the price of 35, local production increases to, say, 900. But because of the higher price, Quantity demanded will decrease. We move from this point to this point on the demand curve. 
and let's assume then quantity demanded is 1,100. Again, the difference between quantity demanded and quantity supplied is the value of imports of 200. Now we can see local producers are better off because production increased from 600 to 900. But consumers are worse off. Quantity demanded decreased from 1,200 to only 1,100. So we must choose. Are we going to look after the interests of producers or consumers? There's no easy answer to that. But to summarize, can you see the effect? Before trade, market is an equilibrium of price of 50, quantity um, of 1,000. Then we opened the market for trade, the world price of 20. So quantity demanded increased to 1,200 local production decreased to 600 and we imported 600. That gives us, that gave us this equilibrium point E where quantity demanded is equal to quantity supplied. Because of the, the workers losing their jobs, um, we introduced a tariff and that increased the price to 35, led to an increase in local quantity supply, so producers are better off but it decreased quantity demanded to 1,100. So consumers are less well off, and imports decreased to 200. 